There is one more thank you we need to say, because today is the final occasion on which Carol Aitchison will be here as our Bishop's Secretary and Office Manager, a job which is so full and so complex that it's now been divided into two jobs, <laughs> fulfilled by Holly and Jenny, whom you've met already. Carol, you've been doing both of these jobs. And if we say thank you to you as you come to your retirement in a couple of weeks' time, it is uh, impossible to find the words that most of us will want to, to say to you. Because you have been, well, sometimes the face of this diocese, but most often the voice of this diocese on the end of a phone. So all of us have had cause to seek help from you in the office, over the years that you've been serving us, and to find reassurance, not just in your knowledge and efficiency and expertise, but in the warmth of your care and your personality, which you've brought into everything you do. I know as a new bishop, I, I, I would have found it impossible to find it so easy to settle in this wonderful diocese without your help and support and assistance. In fact, as we began to talk about the revision of Canon 4 uh, in the province, people said, we wouldn't need to change this canon at all if every diocese had a canon. <laughs> <laughs> it was not going to you, Carol, together with other colleagues, that the process of that election was for me, and I know I speak for my fellow candidates at that time, was not grueling at all. We felt deeply supported and valued and trusted, and uh, you were a large part of that. But I think that experience is repeated by all of us in the different ways we've had to seek your help and rely on your support. Um, it's been a joy for all of us to have you as the voice and sometimes the face of this diocese. And you are succeeded by two people who are uh, going to find you a hard act to follow, but they're doing pretty good at it already, <laughs> thanks to your support and help in this handover time. But now comes the time saying thank you and, of course, farewell. It's not, we hope, personally, because you and Ron continue to live down the road and are part of our community here, but certainly in this role, officially, to say thank you and farewell. And I'd like to embarrass you for <laughs> <laughs> can, and receive a small gift from Dr. <laughs> I have wondered what I would say on this day for quite some time, and I'm still thinking what I'm going to say. So, um, I just, it's been a joy working for you all, and, and I've just learned so much, still learning so much, and I just, I hope that you will offer it. Jenny and Holly, the love and warmth that you have shown me. And, and I do feel very sad to leave you all, but, but I'm going to do some really nice things. <laughs> <laughs> I've worked with an amazing team, and, and I just see the diocese being all of you not just the diocesan team, but, um, but every congregation being part of this diocese and being my fellow workmates. And, uh, and just, yeah, it's been a, a privilege to work with you. Thank you.